time to call this? You're 10 minutes late. <laughs> you here for the apartment tour? Get in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shoes off. Better. Come on. So, welcome back to the channel, guys. In today's video, I'm going to give you the tour of the brand new flat. I know you guys have been wanting to see this ever since I moved out from Will. So, let's get straight into the video. And I can't open the stream. <laughs> I fucked it. <laughs> All right, guys, so as we're in the kitchen, I'll begin with the tour in the kitchen, guys. So my last kitchen was really nice, but this one just has cupboards beyond cupboards. Obviously, you've got everything is still in boxes at the moment, guys, so I'm literally living out of barely anything. Like up here, I mean, I've literally got decaf tea bags, some delicious popcorn, which I've already been seeing through, <laughs> and literally nothing because none of my stuff has properly arrived. So. It is quite frustrating, but it is what it is. You know, when you're at the beginning of a moving into house, everything's in boxes, everything you want to get brand new, so things are still being delivered, but it's all coming. The one most annoying thing at the moment I'm actually dealing with is I still have no kettle, so I'm having to boil all my water on here, on the hob, but I'm not going to lie, the hob is luxurious. Like, I actually love playing around with like the buttons and stuff like that. Like, look, I've only just figured out how to work with this. I swear, when you move into a house, the hardest thing to begin working is your shower and the hob, but I've just about mastered both of them. And the oven, the pizza setting on the oven, that was a difficult one. But let me show you my favorite thing in the kitchen. Come here. So, this is what I like to call the special fridge. So we have the alcohol special with the bottles of wine. Oh, I love that. Now all I need is a decent girl and we can have some drinks from there. Someone, someone's got to help me find a, a nice girl here on YouTube. But anyway, all right guys, we'll come. <laughs> Maybe I should say that. Drop, drop them in the comments below. Yeah, please. All right, come right over to here guys. You may remember this from the last house. This is the alcohol trolley. What's my favorite drink on here? It's got to be the Johnny Walker Blue Label. Basically, I've been doing lots of work with Johnny Walker, but I love their bottle of Blue Label. It's got like chocolatey notes and it's just so delicious. Like the older you get, the more you begin to just like different acquired tastes. And this is certainly one taste you absolutely love. So definitely get yourself some Johnny Walker. But anyway, we will go into the living area, which is like joint to the kitchen. So this is the living space. We've got some lovely furniture here. We actually, this all came with the house, which is wicked. They're like suede sofas. They're so nice. Like they always call me Henry Suede because I love suede. So suede Wade. These are my sofas, which I love. But anyway, this is where, watch the football, stick it on. Do you wanna come sit down? Come sit down on the stairs. Sit down, have a chill. Sometimes you haven't gotta be so stressed in life. All right, so this is it, living space is nice. Nice to always have a bit of chilled area so you can just like not focus on work or anything, watch some TV. At the moment, obviously it's some good sports on. We've got the Euros and the NBA, so we're watching loads of that at the moment. I think the winners of the Euros this year are gonna be France. They beat Germany in their first game. That's probably one of their toughest opponents. But I think they've just got it. France are a good squad. I'm like the worst person in football, but I think they're going to win. But guys, we'll move on to the balcony because if you remember my last balcony, it was just about fit for Will and I. But now the new balcony is epic. So let's get out there quickly. This one is just so much bigger. View's not so bad either. Got a little bit of London, which is pretty sick. All the things I'm thinking about right now is when it's summer. Well, it is summer, but when the weather's better, get a couple of tables and some chairs out here to have breakfast in the morning. It'll just be lovely. At the moment, it's just full of like old gym kit from the last place, because obviously I need to store it somewhere before I get rid of it all. But yeah, let's go back inside and take you to the next room. So this is the dining area. The one thing I love about this dining area is this massive, lovely marble table. So whenever we've got like dinner parties, Christmas events and stuff like that, we can host all our friends over here. And we've also got this uh, cool what do you call these, like islands, kitchen islands? So I can, a breakfast counter, thanks mate. <laughs> so we've got the breakfast bar up here as well, so it's always nice to like work from, or just like have casual, I don't know, conversations, whatever with people, it's just nice. But anyway, let's get into the bedroom guys, come on. So, 
If you remember from our last place, guys, you remember that I had the smaller bedroom, I had no one suite or anything, but I've got the bigger bedroom this time, which is wicked. I've got a big king size bed, which is amazing because obviously you spend a third of your night sleeping, so you've got to focus on your sleep. It is the number one thing you need to be taken care of, guys. Sleep is so important. At the moment, the walls are really bare, which is obviously, I've just moved in, everything's in boxes, but what I want to do is put some like paintings up here, paintings up here, because it's a little bit echoey right now. So it'd be nice to create a bit more of an atmosphere in and do some decorating, and I like decorating, but as you can see, I'm still living out of some bags as well, so I need to sort it all out. But yeah, I've got the canics from the last place as well. My plants, which if you saw in the last video, are still just about alive. And then also the book I'm currently reading down here, Jay Shetty, Think Like a Monk. If you haven't read it, I thoroughly suggest reading it, guys. Train your mind to think like a monk and live for peace and purpose every single day. Like, honestly, it is such a good book. I can take a lot from it. Anyway, let's show you to the bathroom. Let's go. Turn those lights on. So this is my walking on suite. One thing I love about it, guys, not even gonna lie, is the shower. The shower is absolutely huge, which I absolutely love. So that's good. And then I've obviously got in behind here, obviously all my fragrances and all my washware and facial stuff, skincare routine. If you guys want any of that, like a skincare routine or like a list of my top summer fragrances for this year, comment down below because I'd love to do that video for you guys because I think it's actually really important and people want to know that stuff. And then the, I'd say walk-in wardrobe, it's not really a walk-in wardrobe, it's a built-in wardrobe, but I didn't have one last time, so this is epic. One thing I love about it, the light comes off, which is epic. But I'll show you a full breakdown of my wardrobe tour if you guys would like to see that and how I kind of organize all my clothes and everything because when you start getting a lot of clothes, you need to organize it correctly, otherwise it can get a little bit chaotic. So let's go over to the office area, follow me. So guys, as you know, I need an office space to work from. So this is basically it. Last time I had an office space, it was a little bit too congested in the kitchen and everything like that with Will. So we had it like office, kitchen, whatnot. So it's nice just to be able to have a little area where you can focus and do all your editing and all your work. What I'll probably do is put some prints up here, like some motivational quotes or something, and make it like a really cool kind of office vibe, which is wicked. So next place is, I'll show you all my shoes are as well. So this is basically the cupboard where I have to keep all my big jackets. I've got obviously all these nice jackets here. It's like big winter wear from Rod and Gum, which I love. And then I've got all my Boda Skins jackets, which I love. And then obviously all the shoes. Obviously I'm a big shoe man. I know I said to you on the last video, guys, if you want to see my like complete shoe breakdown, then I can do a video on that. So again, comment down below if you'd like to see all my shoes, because I've got a hell of a collection. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to turning this place into like more of a home. I think I'll make this kind of area here my YouTube area, I'll put some more paintings on the wall, so you'll become a little bit familiar with that. But it's just such a nice open plan in space. Like, I think around here, what I'm gonna do is probably better like a nice tall mirror. Um, I wanna put up a couple more shelves and stuff, uh, put some more paintings above the TV, and just make it really homely and really nice, because at the moment, I still feel like I'm living in and out of boxes, which can be proper frustrating. But I've got so much more space, I've got so much more room for that. Activity. So many activities! So looking forward to just creating some wicked content in here. It's a lovely area as well. I've got Battersea Park in London just next door to me. And obviously the kitchen's amazing. I've got so much I can just do around here. I love it. And I'm a big NBA fan as well, if you didn't know. The NBA Finals are on at the moment. And I think, who's going to win the NBA Finals? I'm going to say Phoenix Suns and CP3 and his team, they're going to win. That is basically the flat tour breakdown. I hope you like my pad. And if you guys continue to follow me along the journey, you'll see this place get transformed with some, like I said, cool paintwork. And I'll just show you more of it as time goes along and how I decorated it as well. But thank you so much for watching this video. If you have enjoyed it, guys, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button right down there. But right now, I'm hungry. So you need to get out of my apartment. So come on, head out, get out. Get your shoes back on and get out of the apartment. But until then, you have to take those stinking shoes. I'll catch you on the next one, guys. Peace.